Hi, hello, good evening. Today I will use the IR16 textbook and today's contents is speaking section and part three. So let's get started. The first question, do you think that people are more likely to buy expensive items for their friends or for themselves? So it's a tough question because uh, I have never purchased some expensive item for my friends or for my own or my for myself so just a moment so uh, to their friends to someone's friends i think uh, i think uh, the around my around my friend i think many people don't purchase any expensive items for their friends because they, are, they don't have uh, so much money and if they, someone is very rich the one i think i don't think they don't pur they doesn't purchase anything exp ex expensive for their friends but uh, one of uh, one group of my friends purchased a television for their friends and uh, for uh, for their um, for the moving uh, present, for the moving present, when uh, the some when friends uh, when they moved to moved to other place and they didn't have uh, television and uh, my friend group purchased a uh, television for him, so that is the uh, most expensive I have ever seen. And uh, but uh, the for the example in the example they collected they collected money from uh, all of them so that's why they one one of them paid a uh, small money even they purchased the, the even though they purchased the expensive television so that's why i can't and i can't i can't answer this question because uh, they didn't do so much money for their own to their friends and uh, i think the mm, i think the, the present for someone is uh, cost around the one ten ten thousand yen and that is uh, Marx and because uh, the people who get uh, who the people who get uh, some expensive items from their friends fe would feel very awkward because when the item is very expensive so that's why the people who want to give the present to their friends uh, think about think about uh, the cost of the item because uh, they don't want to make the someone's friends awkward, so that's why they didn't purchase any expensive items for their present uh, for their friend as a present, I think. And the next question, the example question: How difficult it to how difficult is it to become become very rich in today's world? <laughs> that is a tough question to um, I think uh, to do uh, common work as a uh, employee um, we can't become very rich because uh, the rich person do uh, rich uh, this rich person would do very difficult thing for example to establish uh, uh, their own business or they are be a they are a very special artist like youtuber or the celebrity in tv or the superstar of the baseball or something so that's why it is very difficult and they need a very tough um, to become to become a very rich person we have to have a very hard work or very have had 
have 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 to have very rare talent to do something. So that's why I think that is very difficult to become a very rich person in the today's world. Well, I think uh, compared to, compared to the old day, I think uh, the chance is the opportunity. There are a lot of opportunities. For example, I think the like YouTuber or a creator in the internet, they have a lot of chance to appear their some their. Mm, they are appeal thing which is created there uh, which is created by themselves and uh, because uh, before the in before appearing uh, the internet there is no chance to show their um, their um, show their um, creativity uh, in the world, but uh, for now, it is very easy to upload their video or their sound uh, into the internet, and uh, they all that they have to do is to upload and appeal to all over the world, and uh, someone who finds the the very good thing, and they will retweet. They would retweet. Uh, the very good thing all over the world and the next one it will receive it again and again over so that's why it is very there are very a lot of opportunity to show their talent into the world and not the local i think it is the world so and they could they will uh, have a, a lot of money from the advertisement or purchase their creativity that's, Purchase the creative, so I think uh, that's why I said uh, the the chance is just chance to become just chance to become a rich person is uh, no 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 exist uh, a lot of place in the internet, and the next question, uh, do you agree that money does not necessarily be bring happiness? So yes, I think so. I think so. I think because most important thing to be happy is the how the person think. For example, if I find uh, ten yen, ten coin, ten yen coin on the ground, and uh, I think if I think uh, I find uh, only ten yen coin, it I wish it were uh, one billion yen. But uh, on the other hand, if I think, uh, oh, I have, oh, I have found one hundred yen, and I will purchase uh, uh, some sweets on the convenience store, so that make I more happy. And the latter one, I think, uh, about the latter one, I think uh, I feel a little bit sad, and uh, so that's why the only only think the positive think positively that people will be happy and they feel uh, they became uh, very happy so that so that's why i think the money is not necessary to be a happy and but i really i think the money is the one thing to make someone happy so that's why i didn't say i i won't i won't say the money is not necessary to become happy so that is my answer and i agree with the question and in what ways might rich people use their money to help society? <coughs> so I think like the take take Bill Gates for example. I think he used a lot of money to education or education institution over the environmental protection. So that is a very good. So that is very uh, admirable. For them, because uh, they use their money to more people, and they help the people from uh, 